What's up guys, welcome to another video with those bros family travel adventures. And right now we're going to our second stop here in Sedona, Arizona. And the stop is in the Chapel of the Holy Cross, known as one of Arizona's man-made wonders here in Sedona. And if this is your first time with us, remember that our videos include closed captions in many different languages. Excuse the typos that they are created with AI. The Holy Cross Chapel is situated just a few minutes outside of the village in Sedona. We totally recommend staying here if you are visiting Sedona National Park. And if you don't have a car, you can take one of those uh, tours in one of those trucks. They look pretty fun. And who knows, you might get this guy that looks like he's in a hurry to show everybody all the fun things here in Sedona. Judging by the curve that he took in that circle, it looks like he must be a fun ride. One of the most popular things to do here in Sedona is visiting the Chapel of the Holy Cross. Especially if you are a very spiritual person. As soon as you see the chapel, you know you are entering a very special place. The location and the scenery are stunning. The Chapel of the Holy Cross is a Roman Catholic chapel built from 1954 to 1956. The construction supervisor was Fred Cookus, who built the chapel in 18 months at a cost of $300,000. There is plenty of parking, but it's in a downhill, so if you come late or on a busy day, you're probably gonna be parked all the way down there. So it's probably best if you can just come and drive all the way up there, drop whoever you need to drop off, and then go look for parking. Or you will see these golf carts taking people down and up. We are here around 2 p.m. and we were lucky because there's a mass going on at 3 p.m. But first, let's go check out the amazing views that you can see here from the Holy Cross. The chapel sitting here in the high top of the red rocks in Sedona, Arizona was inspired and commissioned by a local rancher who was also a sculptor named Marguerite Stout. The combination of the Holy Cross and the nature just makes you feel so peaceful here. And check out that mansion just under the Holy Cross. Wow, that house is massive. And nothing better than being down there and overlooked by this holy cross. In 1932, Marguerite was inspired to build such a church by the construction of the Empire State Building. Her first attempt to build it in Hungary was broken because of the start of World War II. And once you are walking inside this church, you can just feel the peace. The chapel has changed a little bit. At first, this was not the Jesus Christ that was hanging from the cross. But about five years ago from today, the 32 foot tall bronze Jesus was installed to give visitors an impressive look into Jesus' eyes. The representation of Jesus is way better than the first option because the first one that she had was very odd. And at the time, it angered a lot of people because it almost looked like more like an alien kind of look. And these were the only photos that I can find on the internet about it. There was a lot of hostile situations that she decided to take it down and it was cut into pieces and buried around the chapel in unknown places. If you guys know anything more about this story, please let us know in the comments. When you visit the Holy Cross, there is a gift shop just under the church where you can get stuff like books, keychains and small statues of Jesus Christ. And check it out guys, if you guys took a good look at the photos, there was one where it showed you the first representation of the Jesus Christ. It was indeed very different. On a better side note, the chapel do offer weddings, so if you want to tie the knot here, what a better place to do it than at the Chapel of the Holy Cross here in Sedona, Arizona. And check it out guys, when we were filming, the sunlight that was coming from the cross was pointing at someone or something, so I followed it to see where it was pointing at, and it was pointing exactly directly at the people singing and playing music at the church. This was just amazing to see. And if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to check out these other two videos in Sedona about Montezuma Castle and Sly Rock.